Hey everyone, been a while. I haven't had much to play with you recently. However, I do have um, an update on aqua aerobics. So I went and did two classes of actual aerobics since I last week to you. Um, one I did in the middle of the day, not being at work, when I could um, go and do a daytime class, which was interesting. It had lots of... Um, Retired people, I think, doing um, aerobics um, at quite slow paced. Um, I mean, I didn't ache afterwards. My joints were fine, so that was a bonus. But I did say to my husband, I won't rule it out until I've done an evening class, you know, since people have finished work, etc. afterwards. So that is what I did. I went and did an evening one in, at the local leisure centre. And it... Um, was a bit more upbeat but really not for me the one thing that i can probably it's fair to say is that um aqua aerobic teachers are possibly insane um in a good way i mean they're very lively very excited um but i'm very enthusiastic so slightly mad um uh, lots of people had lots of fun i could tell they were all having lots of fun doing it however uh, you know, a few weeks ago I was deadlifting. I just wasn't as up for sitting in the pool going, ooh, ooh, ooh. So um, I probably will give that one a miss, um, unless I can't do anything else. And then I will do um, aqua aerobics, I suppose. Um, I've been doing yoga and pilates too, which has been good. Um, all my joints. I did go to soft play the other day and put my back out, which was wonderful. So I've now got a slightly achy back as well as everything else. Um, but um yeah hopefully that will go i mean i'm going to the hospital today so maybe they can just give me some really strong painkillers and wipe that out um but yes i go in this afternoon i'm going in between four and five uh no sorry five and six um i'm not really quite sure why i go in the night before um the people on the phone didn't really know either um i think it's maybe just to make sure that you're prepared for the surgery for the next day um so yeah by this time tomorrow hopefully it'll all be over and it'll be done um but i don't i don't actually know where i am on the list or anything um so i packed yesterday um which was interesting because i couldn't really know i didn't really know what to pack um so i've got lots probably of bits and pieces i don't have i have a lot of food i don't know if you're meant to take food to hospitals but i was really worried that i might get hungry so i'm taking you know some little well arthur's lunchbox things really so lots of little saurines and um some little 501 bars some chocolate milkshakes that i had bought arthur he didn't like so i'm having um you know i mean it is the most important thing, isn't it, to not be hungry. So um, that's what I'm doing. Um, I know I'm going to have steroids, I think, for six weeks after the um, after the surgery. So I'm worried about getting that steroid bloat, but there's not much I can do about it. So I think after um, everything's kind of cleared up, you know, I'm hoping to kind of be back at the gym and back on top of nutrition and everything because I haven't really been in the last week or so, um, mainly because it, I, so I had obviously had my injection, um, I'd taken the Creon so I could like digest my food. Um, and then once kind of like my appetite came back, it came back with a vengeance. Um, and so I was really hungry. So I did eat quite a lot, um, over the last week. Um, but you know, manage that afterwards um it's where it's rare um or it's yeah it's rare diseases day on the 29th of february um which is exciting i suppose so lots of people are posting things about that i have become a star um you can have a look at my twitter and facebook accounts for them because they're there uh, um it's just about raising awareness really of um rare diseases which acromegaly is um i don't think there's anything else really to say other than um that's it really so i'll see well i'll try i'll see how i feel about posting tomorrow um but um if not it will be definitely in the week and um i'll be able to tell you how much of the tumor was removed etc uh, um hopefully or at least give an update about how the surgery went um so yeah please subscribe share like uh, um and i shall see you on the other side bye